Okay. Hey. Welcome to week eight. Hey. Week eight is here. Okay. This week's theme is sports. For your wager, Big Brother would like the house to work together. That was the wrong guy. No, I see. Stop. No, it was from the cross. What's the wrong guy doing with you? Nobody. I literally just said it's a person. Why did they face me? I've heard Pacquiao. Which one will I lock down? No, no, no. I'm not saying we should. Know. I'm no, saying anything that's coming up. I'm trying to understand the game. Sorry. Bombo. Bring forward. Enough of you talking and talking. Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. Week eight in Biggie's house, man. We have two weeks and some days to go. Anyways, the brief just came in and the theme for this week is sports. So according to the brief, the brief says that the housemates should create at least four games that do not exist. They should think of a local Olympics in mind while creating this game. And then they should be inspired by their childhood memory games, games they played during their childhood. And when this game, when this wager will be presented, they should have commentator, spectator, umpire, and judge among them, together with those that will be playing. Now, you know, to read the brief is one thing. To understand it, another thing. While it took them like some minutes, you know, to read, read again in order to understand it, Sissy was like, can we just wait till after the head of house game so we'll come back to this? But Marshala was, we're not doing anything, we're idle. And Big Brother requires that we put down the names of the games we'll be playing and submit before night today. So why don't we just, you know, come up with ideas since we are not doing anything, brainstorm, put down those um, games and then submit to Big Brother. Then whoever that will now come in as the new HOH can now take up rehearsals and other things from With there. With this explanation, the housemates were like, okay, you know, let's start uh, mentioning games that we know from childhood that we can go ahead with. And then, uh, Neil mentioned sack race, that during his childhood, you know, you put yourself inside a sack and then you start running. But then Adekule said no, that the game requires that they create something that is not in existence, that the sacrifice is also, is uh, popular. And Omashala was, it's popular, it's all we did in the childhood, in our childhood, but it's not in the Olympics, it's not recognized like as a global sport. We can actually do this. And even Soma was like, can we do something with the catch a strike? Can we create something around catch a strike, catch a strike? But Adekule, you know, started um, opposing them, saying, can the brief be read again that there is something Big Brother requires from them, which is creating a new game? And Shonzi said, but the brief still said, let's go back to our childhood, you know? And Venita and Angel was like, the brief said, you know, inspired. You, you know, it's one thing to read now, but understanding English and another thing. And as English, you know, be our official language for Nigeria, <laughs> understanding it is always a problem. But then, why money said left for him, they would just sit down and start creating games. That is very easy to come up with um, a, a ideas like, you know, create, that you can even with what you have before. They can twist it, they can edit it, they can, you know, recreate with the ones they already have in mind. Why money saying this now and Angel was like, this house and their problem, this house and their wahala. And why money was not like, it's not about this house and their wahala. We are looking for solution. Can you come up with a uh, something? Why are you? You shouldn't talk it that way. And Angel, you know, reacted immediately. I was like, what was that? I shouldn't talk it that way. Don't speak to me like that. So I'm trying to prefer a solution. You know, she just got angry. I think the both of them really misunderstood themselves. Because White was just trying to say, oh, you know, let's recreate. And Angel was complaining about the housemates in general how you know taking ideas is always a problem and my money was not like no i'm not even antagonizing i say can you come up with a solution that everybody here is trying to prefer solution it's not that we don't have games but trying to meet up with what the brief was say is saying is just the problem here did i not say something there i'm confused and nobody's arguing with you nobody angel went ahead to read the brief and this time i said now, what the brief requires from them is to create because the brief said a spot that does not exist that it definitely means they have to come up 
with new idea. And it clearly was like, exactly, this is what I'm trying to say. Big Brother wants her to create a game, you know. But then the housemates were like, how would they even create one? Why can't they retwist the ones they already know? Like uh, the egg game, that they can come up with a style to it. Instead of running with one egg, they will run with two eggs, you know. Since they already, you know, something inspired by their childhood, like the brief said, that they can just twist all those ones they played during their childhood. Meanwhile, Ile Baye mentioned that during their season, a similar task like this was presented to them, and they did exactly, you know, playing what they had in their childhood. And people that said no, that this game already in existence, they were expected to come up with a game that have not been in existence. So moving forward, the housemates say, you know what? Let's bring up those games, um, especially Alex. Alex was like, can we all mention at least two games that we played in our childhood? Then we write it down and now find a way to not twist them. Messi and you record of a game they played in their childhood, I call on. They said I call on is the name. Whereby um, they will mention your name, they will mention a name and the housemate will have to run until someone says stop. You know, they actually demonstrated how it's been played. And they said they will find a way to twist it so that it can fit into this um, wager. Then, Soma and um, Angel suggested the onesie that they can actually use the onesie and form a spot. Like, um, two housemates will be in a onesie and they will have to run. There will be like four, four housemates um, in total, two in one onesie, two in one onesie, and they will have to um compete on a race and know who will come up as the winner which team will come up as the winner with this so many suggested suggestions started pouring in new even suggested police and thief and uh, white money even suggested the rubber band game where they will have to play with rubber band you know they were just demonstrating it but then venita now told um or Marshalla that she has strong interest interest in being an umpire and Adekule now added that he wants to be a commentator. While Angel said she would like to be a spectator. But then Omashala was like, you know, this is not my duty. I'm just doing this now so that we'll come up with a new idea. Any H.O.H. that comes in, any person that wins H.O.H. that comes in, will now determine how he wants to go about the various roles that will now be played. That is the new H.O.H. that will determine all these things. But Venita now said, well, she's just saying she has strong interest in being, not like she can uh, oppose any rule given to her, but she's saying it now that she wants to be, uh, she has interest in, in being an umpire. With this, the housemates now agreed on the various spots they'll be playing, and they now went ahead to start writing down the names of the games chosen. They even said they can do more than four games at the end of the day. And writing now, they started writing the materials they need, the outfit they will need, things they need for the wager to be a success. And Omar Shala even suggested, let there be two teams. And those two teams will wear different color of JC. And the rest of the housemates will now fall in where they have the judge, umpire, commentator, and all that. Well done to Omar Shala. He has really tried because... I can remember there was a week when something like this came. They just said, you know, let's leave it for the next head of house. Thank you for watching and please do not forget to tell me who are you rooting for to win the head of house. Whoever wins this is guaranteed of ninth week. And we just have two weeks to go. The game is getting tougher. Anyways, all the best. To the housemates thank you for watching do not forget to like comment subscribe and share bye